Hi Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I really appreciate all of your love and support. In this reading, we're going to find out who is secretly jealous of you and why. Today is the 22nd of July, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 11.14 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. If you were to finally get it to watch this video, this message is meant for you. Even if you're dealing with the same sign spirits and angels please show me for leo aries and sagittarius who is jealous who is secretly jealous of them and why strength at the bottom of the deck well you have the six of cups as the first card that came out so so this is someone you obviously know could be a childhood friend okay someone you've known for a long time actually you have a lot of history with this person but two swords and the two wands this is interesting this could either mean that you have blocked this person Right? This person may have hurt you at one point in time with the Three of Swords here, and you've blocked them. Please bear in mind it could go vice versa. And the Two of Wands, they often wonder about you and looking back towards the past. They could be secretly jealous of you, maybe because you're embodying the Queen of Pentacles. Unless, if they are the Queen of Pentacles, they could be a Virgo, Capricorn, or a Taurus, okay? Hmm could be secretly jealous of you because either there are few things here to state what resonates with you either you have money or a stable job um, or you have children or you have another best friend six of cups or because you are married okay it's not going to apply to all of you bear in mind but there's something that you have that they don't have because the queen of pentacles is holding this something valuable right the pentacle is something valuable to you or also to them some people marriage is valuable to some people children are valuable somebody so for some people a house is valuable you know it really depends but what's really clear to me right now is that the person who is jealous of you is jealous of what you have and what they don't have because the two swords here is like i don't have it right and they feel sad it's like they're jealous but also they're sad and this is why i feel like it's something that you have but they don't have could be again a job or money children marriage or a home a car your beauty or anything right something valuable again got the not of wands here another thing i'm seeing here that too many cards three of wands three of swords two of swords two of wands too many cards are pointing towards if you are in a third party situation with this person or used to in the past whether it's now in the past but if both of you were involved with someone like the same person this person could be jealous of you because you may have had a history with this person um, or that you c could currently be with this person okay again it could be in the past or currently so because too many cards that indicates there could be someone else present um, bec um, and that could be the reason why this person is jealous because you're with the person that they want to be with see again it comes down to something they don't have that they want but you have it and they don't have it okay that's basically that i feel um and third party situation may not always mean another lover could be friends family external factors internal factors so whatever the case is this person is jealous the bottom line is 
that this person is jealous because you have what they don't have. Could be a person that they had a history with too, all right? Could also, Six of Cups can indicate like an ex also. Some of you currently connected to someone and they have an ex who is still keeping tabs on them with a page of swords here in Lovers. They keeping tabs on them and keeping tabs on you as well. Could be jealous of your love, your relationship with this person. Some of you, it's like best friends too. You may have a best friend who could be jealous of you because you're getting close to another friend. Okay? Bear in mind again, it's like it's like something is coming in between the two of you. It could be that and also it could be that you have something that they don't have. And the three of wands three of wands can indicate business, entrepreneurship. Um, or future. For some of you, this person could be jealous of what your future could look like. Okay, this just reminded me, I, I've been watching this, this true crime YouTube videos, right? And my favorite is Stephanie Su. Um, and she recently told a story about, I think this is in the news, right? These two girls, two women, they were best of friends, and then one of them is getting married um, while she just had a breakup, and she got so jealous that she, she basically put something in her coffee, and she instantly died because of, because of that. Just because that her, her best friend has what she doesn't have, and her best friend's future looks so bright because she's getting married and she's in a, and she's rich and everything is just perfect and she just recently broken up with a boyfriend and she also was suffering from some you know emotional mental instability so she ended up yeah killing her, killing her best friend. So for some of you, it could be someone who is jealous of what they can foresee, how your future is going to be, even if it hasn't happened yet. Okay, I hope that makes sense to you. Hmm. I'm speaking very, very slowly. I'm in a very slow mood, to be honest. And we've got the death card here. So death indicates an ending. So for a lot of you, maybe you don't talk to this person anymore. This is someone from your past, right? But at one point in time, Six of Cups feels like both of you were close. That's the first storyline. Story if not, it could be the second storyline where this person could be jealous of you because you have their man or you have their woman, um, hmm, right? Again, just say what resonates with you. Got the Empress right here in one first. This person is very, very insecure. Very insecure. And the strength here. You're very strong. This is your energy, right? This is Leo, but it's a fire signs reading. So it's Leo, Aries, Sagittarius to me. So your strength, all your strengths is possibly their weaknesses. So they could be jealous of all you have, what you possess, that they don't, okay? And let's see, just a little bit more here. Not a cups. Some of you, it's also because there's someone who loves you, longs for you, misses you, could be an ex as well, who is jealous of you because maybe, because the queen usually has a king, either because you have started a new relationship or that you're doing something in your life with the queen of pentacles here, where it looks good. Or that this person may be wondering if they could have a future with you, but two swords to swords, maybe you've blocked this person. So we got the nine of swords, so it's like a, combination of jealousy and anger that somebody may have for you. Like I'm so angry because 
Leo Aries Sag has everything that I don't have. It could also be an ex who is not doing well for himself or herself while you're doing well for yourself. Who could be jealous of that, of you because of that? Because look at the page of swords here, lovers. Whoever these people are, you could have multiple people who are jealous of you. They have been watching you. They have been keeping tabs on you, okay? All right, Leo Aries Sage, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel. It's called Chelsea Vlogs. It's my travel channel. And for those of you who like to be notified every time when I post your videos and, and every time when I go live, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Whenever I go live, I will do 12 individual sign readings followed by super chat questions and free questions. All right. Take care. Hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.